Franken Tune Franken Tune Studio What the back? Hello and welcome. This is Enrique from Franken Tune Studio. Today we're gonna start a new series of short videos showing how to use our brushes and design packs. In this episode, we're gonna have fun with Concept Master Nature Fire Brushes for Affinity Photo and Designer. Check the link in the description to purchase this pack from our store. There are many ways to use these brushes. Here, I've selected FT Nature Fire Step 1 to create the main shape of our flame. Then, I use FT Fire Step 2 to smooth out our flame's contours. As you may have noticed, this brush's blending modes have been set beforehand. This means colors will burn themselves as you paint. I switch to FT Fire Step 3 to distress our shape even further and give a more realistic feel to our flame. Using a regular orange color only, we can build up our flames without the need of changing colors during the process. Try to keep your strokes as loose as possible. These brushes will generate random patterns for you, so you'll never paint the same stroke twice. Use the brush FT Fire Step 4 to add random sparks and make your fire have some extra movement to it. Finally, we can add a curve adjustment to intensify our colors. Let's switch to the iPad to try a slightly different approach. I start using FT Fire Step 3 to generate the initial shape. Again, keep your strokes loose and try different directions until you come up with a shape you like. Now select Fire Step 2, again to sculpt the overall shape and direction of our flames. Tap with two fingers to quickly undo when necessary. Don't be afraid of going back a few steps to find a shape you really like. These brushes have been designed to give you the most unpredictable results. We wanted to recreate as close as possible the way fire moves and generates random forms in the air. Use your Apple Pencil tilt and direction to create more dynamic strokes. Again, with the help of FT Fire Step 2, let's add more randomness and realism to our flames. Undo and redo as many times as needed until the flow of your flames look natural. Combine these brushes in any order you prefer. The order given on this pack is only a suggestion. You can always try different methods yourself. It's not necessary to use all fire brushes at the same time either. Maybe you'll get better results with just a couple of them. The more you practice, the more you'll get to know each brush and master each one separately and in combination with the rest. I always add a curves adjustment as a final step to boost my flame's colors. As you can see, you can get totally different results each time. Save all the shapes you create to build your own library and use it on different projects. Thank you for watching. Franken Tune Franken Tune Franken Tune Franken Tune Franken Tune Franken